we work really hard here. There's a lot of amazing people at my company and a lot of amazing people at all the companies that are collaborating on Cardano. You look no further than see the Twitter spaces where they talk. Uh, look no further to see the forums, the reddits, all the things. And they wake up every day and they say, we believe in a vision, not my vision, but a, a human vision, a collective vision about how do we make the world a little bit more fair and how do we build infrastructure that has principles baked into it. Now, that's batteries not included because nobody's going to help us. The VCs aren't going to help us. The governments aren't going to help us. They make too much money off of the old system. They love the idea and the words, but when it really comes down to it, they have no integrity or soul because at the end of the day, they're held accountable to only one thing. Did we make the wealthy and powerful more money, more power or not? Because that's who they own. That's who owns them. Those are the LPs. And that's who owns the current governments. The whole point of the cryptocurrency industry, at least the one that was started by Bitcoin, not these new things that are coming that are quite disgusting, but the one that started with Bitcoin was saying, let's just restart and do things a little differently instead of don't be evil, can't be evil, instead of probably won't, can't by design. Everybody has the ability to check each other's work. Everybody has inclusive accountability. Everybody has the capacity to be able to verify that things are what they are. That was the dream. That was the hope. And a lot of people signed up for it and they weren't motivated by money. And we know that because there was no money to be made when this industry was started. The science that has been done over the last six years is voluminous. Not just from us, but from everybody collectively. And we have as a species, as one society, global commons, made enormous progress towards that end of a more egalitarian and fair world where we're all held equally under math. And Cardano is our attempt as a community to try to reflect that, evolve that, and push it along. And there's a little bit of sprinkled magic and scalability and a lot of discussion about interoperability and identity and a lot of work done on governance. I didn't even touch governance at all. And that's another massive, major, enormous component of the puzzle. There's a reason we're number one in GitHub commits. It's not that some person sitting in a warehouse somewhere just randomly clicking a fucking button. It's because there's so many people, so much stuff, so much effort that's going on. And it's a disservice to the entire industry to attempt to compress all of that to a single ego or personality or buzz word or phrase and say, that's that. The work we do is beneficial to everyone. It's patent free. It's open source. And we as a community are solving the hard problems. They're not sexy. They're not something you wake up every day, seeing enormous progress every day. There are setbacks. And yes, at times you have to redo things. And at times you have to abandon approaches and change them and have the intellectual honesty to know when you're wrong and why you're wrong. And at least that's documented so people in the future don't make the same mistakes. But that's what being a pioneer and a trailblazer is about. And that is what is going to get us to a better future. That's what people signed up for. And in an, an era of dopamine addiction and overconsumption of paint chips, maybe those concepts are just hard to understand for some people. And that's okay. They can come along after we win. But we will. Because we have to. Because none of us want to live in a world where we lose.